We're going to take a closer look at this massive project, which has been making headlines around the world. China is a country with a rich history of agriculture and aquaculture, and in recent years, it has been investing heavily in developing new ways to feed its growing population. One of the ways it's doing this is by building massive fish farms in unlikely places, such as deserts. The latest example of this is the $760 million fish farm in the Gobi Desert, which is located in the northwest of China. This area is known for its harsh climate, with scorching temperatures in the summer and freezing cold in the winter. Despite these challenges, China's state-owned company, the China National Complete Engineering Corporation, has taken on the ambitious task of building a fish farm in the middle of the desert. The fish farm covers an area of 200 hectares, which is equivalent to about 280 football fields. It's a massive project that involves building 10 fish ponds, each of which is 5 meters deep and can hold up to 12 million liters of water. The farm will initially produce 10,000 tons of fish per year, with the capacity to increase production to 100,000 tons in the future. The fish being grown include tilapia, a popular freshwater fish that is widely consumed in China and other parts of the world. The project has been hailed as a technological marvel, as it involves using cutting-edge methods to overcome the challenges of farming fish in a desert environment. One of the key technologies being used is a closed-loop system that recirculates water and removes waste products, which helps to conserve water and reduce environmental pollution. Another innovation being used is the use of solar energy to power the farm. The Gobi Desert receives an average of 3,000 hours of sunshine per year, making it an ideal location for solar power. The fish farm is equipped with more than 20,000 solar panels, which provide all the electricity needed to run the farm. The benefits of the fish farm are numerous. First and foremost, it will help to feed China's growing population, which is expected to reach 1.4 billion by 2026. Fish is a high-protein food that is essential for good health, and it's also a popular food choice in China. In addition to providing food, the fish farm will also create jobs and stimulate economic growth in the region. The project has already created more than 200 jobs, and it's expected to create more in the future. Furthermore, the project demonstrates China's commitment to sustainable development and environmental protection. By using solar energy and a closed-loop system, the fish farm is reducing its environmental impact and conserving resources. Despite the many benefits of the fish farm, there are also some challenges that need to be overcome. One of the biggest challenges is the cost. The project has a price tag of $760 million, which is a significant investment. Another challenge is the harsh desert environment. The extreme temperatures and dry climate can make it difficult to grow fish, and there's always the risk of sandstorms and other natural disasters. Finally, there's also the challenge of managing the waste products from the fish farm. While the closed-loop system helps to minimize environmental impact, there will still be some waste products that need to be properly managed. Innovative and sustainable ways of producing food to feed its growing population. While the project faces challenges, the potential benefits are significant, and it's a testament to human ingenuity and resourcefulness. It's also worth noting that the fish farm is part of a larger trend in China of investing in innovative and sustainable agriculture. For example, China is also investing in vertical farming, which involves growing crops in stacked layers, using artificial lighting and controlled environmental conditions. This method has the potential to produce high yields of fresh produce with minimal water and fertilizer usage, making it an attractive option for urban areas with limited space and resources. China's investment in innovative and sustainable agriculture is an encouraging development, especially as the world faces mounting environmental and food security challenges. It's a reminder that with the right resources and approach, we can overcome even the most daunting obstacles and create a more sustainable future for ourselves and future generations. One of the key benefits of the fish farm is its potential to reduce China's reliance on imported seafood. China is the world's largest consumer and producer of seafood, but it's also one of the biggest importers, with a significant portion of its seafood coming from overseas. By increasing domestic production, China can reduce its reliance on imports, which can help to improve food security and reduce its trade deficit. 
Furthermore, the fish farm is also an example of how technology can be used to address some of the challenges of food production in the 21st century. As the world's population continues to grow and climate change poses new challenges to agriculture, it's becoming increasingly important to develop new and innovative ways to produce food that are sustainable, efficient, and resilient. The fish farm in the Gopi Desert is a prime example of how technology can be used to create a more sustainable and resilient food system. However, it's important to note that the fish farm is not without its critics. Some environmentalists and animal rights activists have raised concerns about the welfare of the fish being grown and the potential impact of the project on the local ecosystem. While the closed-loop system helps to minimize environmental impact, there's always the risk of unintended consequences, and it's important to monitor the project closely to ensure that it's sustainable and responsible. Another potential issue is the impact of the project on local communities. While the fish farm has the potential to create jobs and stimulate economic growth, it's also possible that it could lead to displacement of local communities and changes to traditional land use patterns. It's important for the project to be developed in consultation with local communities and for their rights and interests to be taken into account. The fish farm in the Gobi Desert is a complex and sophisticated project that involves the use of advanced technologies and techniques to create a closed-loop system for fish production. The project is being led by a company called China Shipbuilding Industry Corporation, which has expertise in shipbuilding and marine engineering. The company has applied its expertise to the development of the fish farm, which involves constructing a series of interconnected ponds and canals that are used to cultivate fish. The closed-loop system used in the fish farm is designed to minimize environmental impact and reduce water usage. The system involves recycling water and nutrients within the system, which helps to reduce waste and minimize the need for additional water inputs. The system also includes advanced monitoring and control systems that enable precise management of water quality and fish health. The fish being grown in the farm include tilapia, which is a popular species in aquaculture due to its fast growth rate and high protein content. Tilapia is also a hardy species that can tolerate a wide range of environmental conditions, making it well suited to the challenging conditions of the Gobi Desert. The fish are being grown using a combination of natural and artificial feeds, which are carefully formulated to meet their nutritional needs. One of the key challenges of the project is the extreme climatic conditions of the Gobi Desert. The region is characterized by extreme temperature fluctuations, with temperatures ranging from below freezing in the winter to over 40 degrees Celsius in the summer. This makes it challenging to create an environment that is suitable for fish production, as the fish require stable temperatures and water quality. To address this challenge, the fish farm is equipped with advanced temperature control systems that enable precise management of water temperature. Another challenge of the project is the isolation of the location. The fish farm is located in a remote area of the Gobi Desert, far from major population centers and transportation infrastructure. This makes it challenging to transport supplies and equipment to the site and to transport the fish to market. To address this challenge, the project includes the construction of a new transportation network, including a new highway and rail link that will connect the fish farm to major population centers and transportation hubs. The fish farm also has the potential to stimulate economic growth in the region by creating jobs and generating revenue. The project is expected to create hundreds of new jobs in the region, including jobs in construction, operations, and maintenance. The fish farm will also generate revenue through the sale of fish, which can be sold locally or exported to other markets. The project has generated significant interest and attention from the international community, with many experts and commentators hailing it as a model for sustainable and innovative agriculture. However, the project is not without its critics, who have raised concerns about the potential environmental and social impacts of the project. One of the concerns raised by critics is the potential impact of the project on local water resources. The Gobi Desert is a region that is characterized by water scarcity, and there are concerns that the fish farm could exacerbate this issue by using significant amounts of water. While the closed-loop system used in the fish farm is designed to minimize water usage, there is always the risk of unintended consequences, and it's important to monitor the project closely to ensure that it's sustainable and responsible.
In conclusion, the $760 million fish farm in the Gobi Desert is an ambitious and innovative project that demonstrates China's commitment to sustainable development and technological innovation. While there are challenges and potential risks associated with the project, the potential benefits are significant, and it's a testament to the power of human ingenuity and resourcefulness. As the world faces mounting environmental and food security challenges, it's crucial to continue to invest in innovative and sustainable approaches to food production, and the fish farm in the Gobi Desert is an encouraging example of what's possible.